Hello and welcome to one of the most recognisable venues in world football, the Estadio Santiago Bernabeu here in Madrid. I'm Derek Ray, ready here on the commentary position, and alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and commentary midfielder Stuart Robson. And we've got Champions League group stage action to look forward to as Real Madrid try to confirm their place in the knockout phase. It's Real Madrid facing Salzburg. Well, thanks, Derek. This should be a good game because Real have played some great football so far. More of the same today, and they will be going through to the knockout stages. Pavone. Figueroa. Ronaldo. And they stopped them in their tracks. Well, looking at the table, it might be a celebratory occasion for the home fans because they know their heroes could clinch a place in the knockout stages and with games to spare, Stuart. Yeah, it doesn't matter what goes on elsewhere. Play well, get the three points, and they're through. Oh, good skill, and he's managed to beat his man. Can he finish? And he's kept it out, fully stretched, somehow reaching it. Who can they pick out? And the problem not completely solved. Terrific block. Well, it's a good deflection. That'll be a corner. And the danger's still on. Well, not making life difficult for the keeper at all. A wide attempt. Well, he really is danger personified, but in this game, Stuart, what do you think we might see from him? Well, Derek, he's certainly going to be the key player today. Last time out, he scored those two goals, but it's his general play that was outstanding. Opportunity, and a goal to give them the lead. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder, but there's still plenty for him to do. Under all sorts of pressure from the defender, he's just able to keep him at bay and finishes with a plumb. It's a great goal. So the action continues. Will there be a quick response from Real? Defensive cover there on the flank. A fine reading of the situation. Now can they counter clinically? Oh, what an opportunity! And another one! Two quick goals! Will it turn out to be the two-punch knockout? Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Ronaldo. Really inventive stuff from Real here. And possibilities inside the box. Struggling to get it away. Firing it in. No problems for the keeper. Timely intervention. Well, approaching the half-time interval and the first half, Real Madrid really would like to forget all about based on the score. It's got to be! Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper. 
and the electronic board showing one additional minute. And there it is, the half-time whistle, and here's the main story. As things stand, they're not in position to move on to the knockout stages. Well, I don't think they need to panic just yet, but they do need to play better in the second half and get control of their own destiny here. And the second half of this Champions League group stage meeting is underway. Well, big news I'm hearing. A penalty has been awarded in one of the other games. Alex Scott with the details. Well, Leipzig were awarded the penalty. Bad challenge. And now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. Well, deemed to have been a cautionable offence. Well, no question about it. He deserved his booking there. Ronaldo might be a chance here well it had a chance but off the crossbar and a goal kick and another treat from La Liga coming up for you live here on EA TV it's Real Madrid versus Valencia Lee Jae Sung and unable to keep possession plenty of support here oh a perfectly timed pass and he could cash in a goal that's exactly what they needed that should get them believing again well let's see this again the vision to play this through ball is superb, and when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. So the game continues, and that goal puts a different complexion on the match for Real. Well timed tackle. The referee knew that was foul play, but advantage it is. Not a great pass. And the referee blows the whistle. It is a free kick. Good officiating, waiting for the play to stop and now going back to caution him. And it is substitution time at this juncture, not just from one side, but from both. Played in there. Well, no degree of difficulty for the goalkeeper. Salgado. David. This attack looks highly promising. And delivered into the box. Magnificent stuff. And quite the comeback from two goals down. Well, as you can see, this is a wonderful strike. He makes the perfect connection, and he has so much pace on it. It's a great goal. So the ball is running again at 2 all.
giving the ball to the opposition that time well I believe changing circumstances in the Leipzig game Alex Scott can tell us more it's another goal for Leipzig it was a thwarted by the post it's in and this really takes your breath away a comeback and a half Well, here's the replay, and look how quickly he reacts. That's great awareness from him. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. An advantage with them. Referee says play on. And just five minutes remaining. And threading it forward. Oh, a save of the highest order. Well, he got his angles absolutely right. What a good save that is. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Can someone get on the end of this? Well, not cleared away completely. Firing it towards goal. Oh, tremendous goal! Technical excellence to finish that one off. Wonderful to have that in your repertoire. Well, when you see this again, the defending just isn't good enough. The clearance doesn't get enough height on it, doesn't get enough distance on it, and suddenly the ball's being played back into their danger area, and they don't reorganise themselves, and that's why the ball's in the back of their net. So the current scoreline, 4-2. And so that is going to be that. The final whistle here, and they're in a pretty comfortable position because not only have they booked a place in the knockout stages, it's still very much on for them to finish top of the group, Stuart. Yeah, you're absolutely right, Derek. It's job half done at the moment. They'll still want to take that top spot, though. It could make all the difference going into the next round. And I think it's fair to say he'll be happy with his own contribution in this game, Stuart. Well, I thought his all-round game was excellent. It was his ability to find space that impressed me most. And with a bit more luck, he could have had a second one today.